This is Las Vegas Real Estate Now, where we bring you the three E's, educate, empower, and engage. I'm your host, Harvey Blankfeld, and we've been selling homes here in Southern Nevada since 1988. We're also very proud to be part of the Real Estate Radio Network. That is a national network of local real estate professionals delivering timely, balanced truths about local market conditions. And I ran into another uh, very interesting man, Mr. William O'Donnell, who's the Vice President of Technology at Avisite. Uh, welcome, Mr. O'Donnell. Hey, thanks for having me. I appreciate it. My pleasure. Listen, you guys are all about drones. Uh, and it, I learned some interesting facts as I was looking at some of your uh, literature. Um, but uh, drones are, are just taking over the world, aren't they? They are. They, uh, the uses for drones, I mean, it just it keeps on invading different types of uh, you know, industries. And, you know, obviously why we're here at the Real Estate Expo is, you know, drones themselves are, are being used on a day-to-day -day basis to be able to sell houses, market things. Uh, but, you know, obviously the limits, uh, uses are limitless. Yeah, clearly. And, and we're seeing so many more uh, realtors and, and sellers taking advantage of this drone technology by having these drone shots of their beautiful backyards and homes and even some interior shots. I've seen some too, which is pretty amazing. Yeah, some of the newer drones, uh, it, they're really nice. I mean, they, they just keep on getting smaller and smaller. They have specialized sensors that can uh, be able to fly indoors. And, you know, you can be able to get some dynamic shots, both interior and exterior, that you just otherwise would never be able to get before that can showcase a house. And that's a service you guys provide to realtors and sellers uh, to have drone uh, photography of their property for marketing. Yeah, so uh, what we do is we kind of have a two-fold business plan uh, targeting the real estate market. Uh, one is uh, providing services, actually going out there, flying, uh, being able to take stills and video. All our stills, um, we actually do a five-bracket exposure. Um, what that is is it's uh, high dynamic range shots. Um, that's where, you know, when you look at the, the pictures and where the colors just really pop out and things look super crisp, it's because it's taking five different shots. Uh, and then we actually, on the back end with post-processing, We'll put it together, and that's where we'll, we'll make those, those yeah, images really just pop yeah. out. Uh, trust me, guys. I know we're on radio, but trust me, the, the pictures are phenomenal. And what he's talking about is is the way that they get the detail from far away and close. It's just very, very dramatic, highly detailed. Uh, but the other thing you guys provide, and this was where it was really got interesting, is you provide drone training. Now, I mean, to me, a drone, I mean, if I, if I, if I know how to do uh, play a computer game, I think I could fly a drone, can I? <laughs> well, you know, I'll be honest, the, the easiest part about drones themselves are flying. They, right. they, they've become so intuitive. Right. Uh, flying them is very easy. It's the rules and regulations on the back end that a lot this of people the, just don't know about. This is the interesting part. Yeah. Tell, us, tell us about this FAA license that's required. Tell yeah. me about that. Yeah, so, you know, I talk to a lot of real estate agents and realtors, and they, you know, I say, hey, if you consider drones, and some, some have, and some have even used them in the past. Right. And I said, you know, well, you know, are you actually licensed to be able to fly them through the FAA and they said oh well I just use them to, to take pictures well you know unfortunately the FAA last year um, said any commercial use of uh, drones needs to be part under part 107 which is an actual uh, actual real pilot license that you can get wow. um, it was it was last August these these new rules came out so even if you you know go and fly and you use them just once to take a picture but you use that for any commercial business per, you know purpose right um, it's a ten thousand dollar fine if you wow. are not actually licensed. And a lot of people just don't know that. Um, yeah. And so we offer that training to get people acu you know, actually licensed. They'll walk away um, being able to take their FAA test, uh, and they'll actually have a real pilot license, and they'll be considered a pilot. That's phenomenal. So, And, and is it, it, sounds, it sounds really expensive, though. I mean, how much does it cost to get training to be a drone pilot? So uh, considerably cheap uh, in comparison. Uh, right. You know, so our two-day course um, is you know, two days of ground training. We don't do any flying in the in the two day course. Gotcha. Um, we teach people how to uh, you know look at sectional charts, uh, aeronautical maps, controlled airspace, things that you know you generally wouldn't have to worry about unless you're going to be flying. Right. And that course is seven hundred ninety nine dollars. Wow, so that's it's, not bad. Uh, you know, so for the cost, you would normally pay somebody to come out and image your property just a few times. Right. Being able to take the training and taking that service in house and doing it yourself, you end up saving the money in the long run. Outstanding. Hey, I think it's a tremendous service you're providing and information. This is what we're all about, teaching people stuff. And I think that this is something that I had no idea that you needed to have an FAA license. And I'm sure a lot of our listeners didn't know that either. Uh, so if you're using any kind of drone for any kind of commercial work, now you guys do films and TV and all that stuff too, right? We do, actually. We uh, we do a lot of commercial work for television shows. Uh, we are the drone company for the television show Vegas Rat Rods on the Discovery Channel. Oh, cool. Um, we've also done feature film work. We just film, uh, finished filming filming a movie a couple months ago in Cape Cod. Um, that movie will be out later this year. I can't talk about it. Sweet. But uh, 
you know, we also have contracts with uh, major uh, film production companies. Uh, you know, one maybe being a mascot having a mouse, but I don't know. Oh, you know, uh, nice. <laughs> nice clue. Hey, listen, I want to thank you so much for taking a little bit of time with me, Bill. And this was interesting information. I know our listeners are going to appreciate it. Uh, guys, uh, so, Bill, tell us how we can get in touch with you if we want to go ahead and get a uh, lesson. Yeah, so uh, for the training side, it's avasitedroneacademy.com. So it's A-V-I. S I G H T mm-hmm. drone academy.com. And then our services side, if you just actually want us to come out and film, it's avisite.com. Once again, A V I S I G H T. And what we'll do is we'll set up some links on our site, guys, too, at RERNLV.com. So you'll be able to see uh, William's site. And we'll, we'll, uh, I'll work out a deal with Bill. We'll get, we'll get him cross reference so you get to see him from our site as well. Bill, thanks so much for stepping up. Hey, thank you very much. And if you uh, mention this radio show, I'll give you guys uh, 10% off on your uh, drone training. How about that? Nice job. Well done, Bill. Thanks so much. Thank you. Appreciate it. You've been listening to Las Vegas Real Estate Now with host Harvey Blankfeld. Please tune in every Saturday at 11 a.m. right here on News Talk 720 KDWN.